cutting of a double mat circle opening to be centered in an 8 by 10. Being a circle, not an oval, we don't have to worry if the mat is vertical or horizontal. To make things easier, we'll cut the mat as a vertical, which denotes at the back, if 10 inches is our height, we'll set our guide to half of that, five inches, using the first measuring guide with the red line. Lock that in place and snug. We have enough scrap, so we'll cut a practice run on a scrap piece of 8x10. The 8x10 board is slid in to the cutter and centered. And on our cutter, our guide is off a small amount, so we set it to minus a 16th on the left plus a sixteenth on the right. Once that's in place, we tighten our side locking knobs, clamp down, clamp down, wiggle the mat to see if it has any give. Does a little bit, open, open, and tighten it just a little bit more on each side. Lock again, lock again, nice and firm. We have a circle opening that measures at four and three eighths. We'll only be using the top measuring bar and we use the top main silver measuring bar to be used when your cutting head is at the outside position. We only insert the cutting head to the inside position when cutting really small circles that are under three inches. Then you'll be utilizing the top black measuring bar. So the back side, you reach around back to loosen the tightening knob and slide to four and three eighths using this marking point here and tighten. Without the cutting head coming down, do a gentle test run to see if it contacts at the back. This will occur when you have a smaller map border and you'll have contact and you'll have to watch out for that. So, it spins smoothly, so then we use the turning knob to bring down the head to put pressure here. Just light pressure, so it's held in place. And now we're ready to cut. End of part one.